Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm unboxing some dolls that a dear friend sent to me. She was downsizing these dolls and she asked me if she could send them to me and I was like, yes, all dolls are always welcome here. And she sent me other dolls in the past and I'm just so grateful for her friendship and I'm so grateful for the thoughtfulness that she always has to send me these wonderful items and that she would think of me to do this. And so I wanted to unbox them today because it was just, it's, it's always overwhelming to me um, when I experience kindness like this from other people. It's just so, you know, it's just awesome. So anyway, oh look, we got some little Matilda Atelier items and some overalls, some shoes, clothes, and overalls, and some little Matilda Atelier items. Look how sweet. And I'm gonna show you, this came from the same wonderful person who sent me the little Matilda Atelier. She even put purple paper inside. How sweet is that? Oh, and she sent me some chocolate. Is this chocolate? How cool, oh gosh. I love chocolate so much. This is so awesome. Um, so anyway, yeah, I just, I'm, I'm like, I'm just so, I feel so fortunate and so lucky to have so many wonderful friends in the doll collecting community. And I am so grateful to you, my friend, for sending this stuff my way. So, Let's get into it. A little Matilda Atelier bag. Can you start to guess what this is? You might be thinking this is Blythe, but spoiler alert, it's not Blythe. So let's check it out. I know what it is. So let me show you. And it's very exciting. Let's see. Okay. It is a custom. Lorena doll check her out and she's on a jointed body this is the um, the vinyl joint or the plastic it might be plastic and vinyl jointed body oh my gosh I don't have this do I have this face I don't think I have this face and you're automatically overwhelmingly hit with the I'm gonna pull her wig down a little cuz I think it's oh no it's not her wig it's her bangs to cover up her Look how, this is a really nice wig. This feels like real hair, like human hair. Wow. She is dressed impeccably, you guys. Impeccably, impeccably. She is so gorgeous, so, so gorgeous. I'm trying to see if this is the one by Little Matilda Atelier or this might be by another artist. I'm not sure, oh my gosh. She is so sweet. I love the color of her eyes and the freckling on her face. That is incredible. That is absolutely incredible. She is stunning. And I love that smell. The, the Palerina dolls have that vanilla smell. Even after being painted and sealed, she still has that. To me, it smells like birthday cake. It's supposed to be vanilla, but to me, it's very much like a birthday cake smell. Oh. I love this so much. All right, let's open the other doll. And look, y'all, okay, I am supposed to, was supposed to meet this friend at Wonderland of Play. I know I keep talking about it. Like, I know y'all are sick of hearing it, but I was, that was the main thing. That was the main thing I was disappointed about not being able to go to this show is I had so many friends that I was going to get to meet for the first time because it's not every day you get to meet your European friends. Um, it's harder for them to come here to the States and I was just really excited to meet so many friends and that was what was so disappointing. It wasn't even that I missed the doll show. It was that I, I wasn't going to meet the friends that I had lined up to meet. That was what was the most disappointing thing for me about missing that. But anyway, there are future dolly adventures planned. That's all I'm going to say. I don't want to jinx myself. So just put it like that. Um, let's check out this sweet one. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love her. I love her. I love her. Oh my gosh. I love her. Oh, okay. And you know what I love? I, I think they might both be by little Matilda Atelier. You know what I love about these dolls is that 
they're dressed for the fall and I have been, it is the middle of July and I'm craving for fall to get here so badly. I cannot wait for the fall to arrive. And these girls are perfectly dressed in that fall aesthetic. And when fall comes like these, oh my gosh, these outfits are amazing. They're so well, they're so detailed and beautiful. And then she sent another extra outfit I think she tried the Palerina dolls and that size is just not for her. And that a lot of us do that. A lot of us will try a doll and then the size is just, you know, it's not right for us. So, oh, there's some little hair clips here and this. That's so cute from Little Matilda Atelier. There's hair clips in there. And then um, a couple little shirts to, again, perfect fall shirts. Wow, and then some extra shoes even. These are such nice shoes. Oh my goodness, wow. And I have another, I have a couple other custom Palerina dolls and they're so gorgeous y'all. The Palerina dolls make a wonderful, they're a great doll. Okay, so if you, if you are starting to collect dolls and you wanna collect an artist doll but you don't want to blow the bank on like a artist BJD or something like that. These custom Palerina dolls are great dolls for collecting because they're not as expensive. Now, depending on the artist, certain artists can certainly go for a lot more money. They're not as expensive as some of your other artist dolls because they are, the, the Palerina dolls themselves are really Playline dolls, but the artists that customize them, they turn them into works of art and they're so beautiful. And I think they're just such great dolls. I was thinking the other day, I'm gonna make a video about the best dolls i did like a video about 10 dolls to start your doll collection but i've i've been wanting to make a video like for younger people who are going to start collecting for younger people that want to start collecting this is a great doll to start with it's a great doll for adults too like mature collectors i love all kind i love playline i love y'all know i love all, everything i love all kinds of dolls the only that kind of doll i don't collect is a baby doll but all kinds of Playline dolls and stuff. I think these are really great dolls, especially if you've got a young collector that's wanting to get into collecting. They're just so, they're so lovely. And so let's see what this is here. I'm not sure what, oh my gosh. Would you look at this? This is incredible. This is like a weighted little teddy. Oh my word. Wow. This is a little piece of art right here. And and she's like pink. She's got like pink and coral colors and a little pink patch on her heart. A little button nose. Well, it's not a button. This is like, I think it's a polymer clay nose. And little eyes. Oh my gosh. This is just, this is a piece of art, you guys. I mean, all of this is. This is just, it just fascinates me how artistic people can be and how amazing they can they can create these things like look at this oh oh my gosh i love this so much these dolls are fabulous so fabulous i adore them and they're perfect right now they're, like they're the perfect they're the perfect fall mood which i'm in they're perfect for that i mean look at them you know does anything say like they're just totally Cottage core Mori Girl fall style dolls. <laughs> For lack, I mean, you know, to use all the buzzwords, but oh my gosh, they're just so perfect. And I love these little jointed bodies. They're really sweet. They're really, really sweet. Oh, y'all, my heart. Ah, I, I just can't believe it. So I just want to say a big thank you to my friend who sent me these things. I, I cannot, words cannot express how grateful I really am to you for this and um, can't wait to meet you soon. Wink, wink. I'm just going to say that. And um, I will leave the artist information below as well so you guys can check her out. It's Little Matilda Atelier. She's amazing. I'm one of her patrons on Patreon. She does incredible work. She shares a lot of stuff on Patreon too. So if you're looking to support an artist who, who actually engages in their patreon account and and shares things she's a wonderful one to do because she posts something she posts things daily and so i think that's really really admirable because i don't i don't post nearly as much on mine as i would like to but she does a great job doing hers so i'll link her information below as well 
Thank you guys so much for watching again. Thank you to my friend who sent me these items. I, I'm so appreciative of you. And we will see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. I want to say a huge thank you to my patrons from Patreon. Lindsay S, Leah W, Doreen Z, Janice H, Mercedes W, Cindy K, Bear Sunflower, Diane B, Kelly L, Cindy L, Susie W, Krista R, Victory Run, Shorna R, Shower Star Hobby, Stephanie W, Jessica S, Ray M, Asia C, and Black Y. Thank you so much for your support. Your support helps me continue to bring you great Dolly content. For information on how you can become a supporter of this channel, please check the link in the video description. Thank you for watching.